This is the mansion at Beauvoir, 1870s, 1880s. Uh, kind of the retirement home for Jefferson Davis. Uh, after the surrender, they caught him in North Georgia and put him in prison for two years. So he came down here to golf and relaxed, retired, wrote his memoirs. Wrote his memoirs in that little building over there. That's called the library. He'd sit in there and write. During this time and later, by the way, this little cottage is for rent. You can come here and stay in this little cottage, the guest cottage. And I'm parked in the west field, way out yonder. In the west field used to be barracks, hospital barracks. And the soldiers from the war would come here and no place to go, so they'd get patched up here and get doctored and kind of a retirement place. This whole field had, uh, I don't know, 10 barracks. And many of them stayed until they died. And back in the back is a cemetery with many of them, over 300, I believe. Could be higher, I'll find out. But this is on the uh, Registry of National Historical Sites. So it's a always kept period, to the period, repairs and replacements. It was damaged pretty good in uh, Katrina, but they brought it all back. And there's tours. You can take a tour of the house and the museum behind the house. Lots of good stuff. Lots of good history here. This is the Beach Boulevard, Highway 90. It's a little busy now, but at 10 o'clock it gets real quiet. And off in the distance is a piece of land that goes out. You can see the lighthouse out there. That was the President Resort and Casino until it got destroyed in a hurricane. And there's supposed to be a new developer coming to put something else back up there but out on that little spit of land you can drive out there and spend the night if you want no cops or creeps you can fish out on the seawall and uh, way out there is Cuba somewhere they're restoring this fence that got blown over in the last couple of hurricanes and uh, they're very particular about putting it back together. I said, hey, use vinyl, use steel, something. No, nope, it has to be wood, has to be certain dimensions. Historic and archives is the deal. If you're going to be on the National Registry, you've got to keep this thing real. Always enjoy camping here. The Coast Coliseum is right next door. Lots of events there and concerts. Well, let's go get a snack. <laughs>